Kids, the channel for learning about trading and investing. Welcome to a brand new episode of Weekly Stock Picks where we look at trading opportunities based on momentum, no, either a break or pull or pull, pull back or whatever kind of trade opportunities are there that seen the stocks listed in the NSC. Right, so that this is uh, the stock picks for the week that's starting from August 16th. August 15th tomorrow is a holiday and it's for the week that is starting from Tuesday to right, the end of the week or a you know, few days before beyond that as well, right? So the first one in my list is Bharat Forge, right? Bharat Forge, a few words on that. It's if you're not aware, it's you know, it's uh, one of the largest uh, auto common manufacturers and uh, uh, it has a lot of presence now, more than 50% of its revenue is coming from the international market and it's one of the world's largest forging company, forging component or auto, you know, auto component manufacturers in the world, right. And when it comes to our country, India is one of the uh, biggest global hub, you know, for auto component manufacturing or sourcing, you know. So this, that's a brief about the industry background and, you know, uh, and about the company, the power forge, right. Now let's look at what do we have uh, in the charts. What does the chart say? So the charts weekly, the medium term chart is showing a clear cup and handle, beautiful formation, and the breakout has happened. You can see that you know, it is broken out of the channel, which is a handle part of the cup and handle. Cup and handle weekly is very powerful. You can see that the moment the most for the medium term is now gone into the bullish zones, and trend is also in the bullish zones. Right, so. There is so, but you no. Know, if you take a long position above the neckline, right, there could be some resistance that may come in the all-time high level, at, uh, you know, and then some pullback, and it may take some time, right? You know, it's a swing trade; it's not a intraday trade or something like that, right? So, the risk reward for cup and handle on medium-term weekly charts are very powerful, and it can extend to as much as the length of the, you know, the cup part of it, right? It can go up to that, but it may be slow, and it may not happen in one or two weeks. So we are not going to wait for that. We would exit much before that, right? So uh, momentum is good. Trend indicated radix is also showing it's good. And auto sector as such is one of the most bullish sectors as of now. Auto and FMCG are two sectors which are showing momentum bullishness, right? Clearly. So by the first, of course, you benefit from the when the, when the auto sector is moving. Now the entry would be seven ninety nine, right? Uh, uh, and uh, the exit uh, stop loss will be 703. The risk reward is 1 is to 2, it's, really, it's, it's reasonably good. And we will charge it for a 998 kind of levels, you know, which is falling very close to the Fibonacci 61 extension, FIB extension projections. You know, uh, if you look at that, right? And uh, it's for the medium term swing trades. And uh, this, uh, well, as I say, you know, all it can be tried in futures options, cash, you know, whichever components you are comfortable with. And, the portion size, capital size of that has to be based on as your capital and the trading has can be enabled, pyramid can be enabled, that's your description. Whether you want to book the profit early and come out or you can want to trade it or you want to add and pyramid more portions to that, more quantity to that, it's all up to you. Right, but uh, you should keep a watch of the extension, the different support resistances levels or extension from match levels before you trade it. Right. So that's about uh, Malfoot. The second in my list is Ambuja Cement. Cement it's um, India's largest cement manufacturer, one of the one of the leading cement manufacturers. I, I won't say largest. Let's see, it's a leading cement manufacturer and it is part of a global conglomerate. You no, know, it's a there's a Swiss company that is bought and stake in this and then it's a good dividend payout. Uh, you know, investor friend you know, in, in that attracts investors basically. So it's a dividend paying payout is decent enough if you look at the fundamental side of it. So it's almost debt free also is what fundamental reports are showing. Now India is uh, just a brief on India's press. India is one of the second largest or one of the second largest cement manufacturer in the world. I don't know whether I was not aware at least. I'm not sure whether you would be aware of that. It's closely linked to that. So we'll come to that later. So it so um, let's get in the chart. So yeah so one of the um, Let's get to the charts and see why, why this stock goes. But you can see that the moment in the medium term and short term is bullish, definitely. And there is an inverted cup and handle breakout that may happen. There is a potential for this to happen. So, inverted, I'm sorry, it's not a cup and handle, it's an inverted head and shoulder. This is the 
head and these are the two shoulders remember we had a similar pattern on the top side which resulted in you know a big downfall correction and now it is inverted so it can move up is what it indicates if it breaks this neckline point so we are trying to take a position above that neckline probably you may get stopped out we are giving a little white stop loss below the very close to the 23 retracement level extension Fibonacci extension retracement levels and then we are uh, you know, looking for a target very close to the 7 Fibonacci you know about the 61 percentage Fibonacci extension that's a target reasonable risk reward so so what we are basically looking for in the cement is the risk reward of 1 is what is 2 1.5 this is a mistake that is written here it's 1 1 is to 1.5 is what we are doing that's the risk reward so it's a breakout entry you have to enter uh, uh, above the candle alert candles high as you can see here the entry has to be above the alert candle the neckline basically it has to be so if you look at the entry at 392 and then you know, a stop loss of 350 right nearly 40 points of stop loss and you'll get a good risk reward and you can look for Fibonacci 61 extension kind of levels f455 can be the target Entries can be in futures options, portion sizes can be as 1% of your capital and stop loss can be traded. Treatment can be done if you want to hold on to the portions for longer time. But this is a swing trade recommendation that we have. Not a recommendation, um, no, uh, for education purpose again. This is not a recommendation, I am not a SEBI registered analyst to give recommendations. But uh, this would be a good, uh, from an education point of view, this would be this charts are you know, educational in purpose primarily. Right? So the levels are clear. and. Um, Sector also is closely similar to sector as connection with infrastructure and reality. If you examine the reality and the infrastructure, both sectors are showing bullishness in the short term. Capital handle pattern can be seen on the medium term on the rea no, re reality sector. Right? Infrastructure also having a flat breakout if you look at the charts of the index of the infrastructure. Right? So overall the sector also looks fine. Momentum is there, trend is there. Price pattern is having a good inverter hammer. And uh, if you get the signal that a breakout is happening above the neck, neck line of the inverter, then it could give it would be a good risk to our trade in the cement sector, right? So moving on to the third pick, torrent power. It's a power energy sector stock, and India is one of the it is one of the third largest producer of power, right? And the second largest consumer of electricity in the world. Then that world. That's that's what we are. So power sector is that crucial for our. So there are been good correction that has happened if you look at the charts here you can see that the good amount of correction and attempt to move up and then again another correction that has come in and uh, this is one of the um, india's leading torrent power is one of the india's leading power utility company right and that's giving a decent you know, dividend payout also right why we have picked, uh, picked the stock momentum is good on medium term and short term trend radius indicator is bullish both so, no, so, so all the indicators on the moment when the trend is bullish and the price pattern is showing that there is a rounding pattern breakout that could happen. Risk reward is put at 78 for no Fibonacci extension that levels. An entry would be a breach of the confirmation of a uh, neckline breakout. So the, the breakout is confirmed, we may, we may get stopped out, but we are putting it just below the close of the previous candle. Right? Entries at the neckline exited just below the previous candle's close. So we may get another chance to. And the breakout may fail, that could be possible, but as of now, indications that momentum trend and an emerging potential pattern also is coming out. And overall, the related industry power sector also is having a good uh, uh, trending, you know, trend line channel move is seen in the index also. So, overall, it looks bullish. And uh, remember that the entry has to be when you get a confirmation of a breakout that is happening in all these breakouts, right? A lot of them is confirmed, right? Even this is. Balance forge also is not confirmed. The confirmation would be if the price moves above the weekly candles high. Right. Similarly, here the confirmation would be if there is a neckline level that is there created somewhere at this level levels that we mentioned about. If there is a breakout is confirmed, a clean close above that or you no know, above the high of the resistance zone, which is part of this neckline, right? Only then we make the end. Otherwise, we sit back and then don't trade. Right. Here also same. If the confirmation of the rounding pattern breakout is only then we take the trade. So to keep a close watch of these levels of entry, that is very important. Right? We may not have any trade also, or we may get stopped also. All this can happen. It's part of the trade. I hope you uh, liked, you know, the stock picks uh, at least from the analysis point of view. In the small position, you no know, few quantity, not big quantities. It may be worth trying out, and uh, from the learning point of view, to take few quantities and see how the price pattern moves. You no, know, that would be 
a great and uh, uh, and uh, you know that's a way uh, to go about uh, trading in uh, stocks right uh, hope it helps if if you like it so hit the like button subscribe definitely if you're not done that share to maximum we have very few solutions you know it may help I, it, this you know more solutions would only motivate me to do pro much more deeper analysis and give the best content for you right so thanks for watching happy trading happy learning happy investing bye